Okay, I should see if Finn hit the new form in the gym theater. Hey, Danica. I'm at the underground hideout on the Upper East Side. Cool. You look for the jammer, I'll start pulling records for what the underground's been up to here. No one's getting past me. There are of me. Hey, Spider Man. I ran a custom search of this address with some underground specific queries. This used to be a tombstone hideout. Whoa. What's the history there? The underground and tombstones crew did a few jobs together robberies, pits, carjackings. Falling out when a member killed one of Tombstone's guys. The underground were outgunned. Until the Tinkerer came along. Yeah, and by then Tombstone was in prison, so they were able to sweep in here, no problem. <laughs> Maybe off topic, but do you have like a sound guy to write your intro music? Uh, I dated a guy for like half a minute and he was nice enough to write my singer before we broke up. Oh, if you ever need someone who mixes beats, I uh, I know a guy. That would be amazing because I am totally tone deaf. Who's there? Enrique, how's it look? Enrique? Somebody should check on him. I'll check.
cool. Now I just need to find the jammer and shut it down. There's the jammer. They kept trophies from their fights with Tombstone. How sentimental. Did those mannequins move? Whoa! This place is ours! You're not taking it from us! I never want to see another mannequin. Hey, hideout should be back on the grid. Okay, tipping off the cops. Cool. I'm gonna chase the Tombstone Underground Partnership lead for my series. I should head out before the cops get here and cover everything in crime tape. Hey, I've been checking on all the hideouts we've shut down. Recruiting's tanked, and those blocks have gotten way safer. That's great. Thanks for calling them in. I wouldn't have found the jammers without you. So, I was looking through my files. It seems like the Tinkerer was working on some big secret project in Hell's Kitchen. Is it new form related? No, it looks like... programmable matter? i faced that stuff before. Maybe I should take it off her hands. Oh, hey, there's a code referenced here. 2658. Maybe try that if you find something... You know, what? 2658. Got it. Thanks again, Danica, for doing your podcast. Those tips at the end of your episodes have been life changing. Oh, well, I'm glad. Thanks. When my underground series is out, let me know what you think. Sounds good to me. Talk to you later. I should get back to looking for the new farm. Time to hit the theater. Hey man, great news. Shutting down those Roxxon labs put a serious dent in their reactor production plans. That is great news. They may not be done for good yet, but we just saved a ton of people. Celebratory hot dogs are on me next time I see you. <laughs> I'll, I'll take it. Thanks, man. Okay, I should see if Finn hit the new form in the gym theater. Six five eight, right? Programmable matter. I can make this into anything. Oh, I'm digging this.
think that'll do it. I gotta thank the Annika for the tip. Okay, I should see if Finn hit the new form in the gym theater. Okay, I should see if Finn hit the new form in the gym theater. You're right, Genki. Underground are everywhere. You might say they're overground? <sighs> Keep working on that one. <clears throat> Barriers electrified. Ow! And not friendly. Your suit says that was 300 kilojoules. How is that just ow? Benefits of bioelectricity, I guess. Power can be supplied all locally. Any sign of the power source? Several. Bet these cables lead the way. Electrified barrier is next level. Maybe they got nervous after someone infiltrated Fisk Tower. Who do that? Nobody's here. You think it was Spider-Man? Them anywhere? Alright, drained it. Feeling good. Now for the others.
Now I gotta drain that generator. Cool, cool, chipping away. Ground. Soon to be no more generator. That did it. Barrier's fresh out of power. And prime for smashing. <laughs> that was the way to the main auditorium. Now it's blocked. Oops. Maybe there's a staircase. Or an elevator. Like that elevator. If I can lift it. Hey man, I I'm thinking. What if you told Finn you're Spider-Man? Yo, Finn. Not only did I lie about joining your club, but I'm also the guy trying to stop you. Okay, yeah. We can work on the delivery. Giant armored silo looks promising. Really feeling like my gaming rig is underpowered right now. Yeah. Finn's going full supervillain layer here. Are you seeing this giant armored container thing? Totally not suspicious. You think the new form's in there? I got a hunch, yeah. Has got cables running away from it. No wonder. Rick's invention. Krieger doesn't understand New Form well enough to make more, but Finn does. She mapped out how its reactivity works. That's one. Need to power the others. So why do you think I should tell Finn I'm Spider-Man? 
Don't you think she might react badly? Let's make a pros and cons list. <sighs> Pro, she's your best friend. Besides me. Con, she's a tinkerer. Pro, talking to her is easier than sneaking around behind her back. Con, the other Spider-Man was super clear. Don't tell anyone who you are. You told me. Maybe if she knows it's you she's fighting, she'll rethink the whole tinkerer thing. Maybe you're right. Finn's been making new weapons to deal with me. Guess she told the rest of the underground to keep tabs. Two. Hope this is a good idea. What's the worst that could happen? She says the guy 30 blocks away. <sighs> Looks like Finn's making a new mask? A shield? As <sighs> soon as I find a way around the underground's weapons, she comes up with something new. Direct connection. Might be able to use that relay node to run a daisy chain. Three down. One to go. Nice. Clear line of sight to the generator. That sounds promising. Gotta check for a supercomputer. All right, what are you up to, Finn? Finn's pumping energy into the new form, and making it unstable like my Venom did. Which exploded the bridge. So... what? Does she want to blow up the theater? <sighs> Not the theater. Roxxon Plaza. Whoa, what? That's... how could she... It's not open yet, so there'd be no casualties. But I can't let her do this. I'm taking the new form. Come on. Come on! Crap, crap, crap! Spread out! He's here somewhere! I need to get the new form. After I deal with her glow stick army. Just to... Put it out there. What if Finn's right? And this is the best way to beat Roxxon? Finn's not just talking about throwing a rock through a window. She wants to blow up a building on my block. If any part of her plan goes wrong, people will get hurt. I can't let her take that chance. You're right. Let's get that new form out of here. Don't think I'd no, you're lucky, game. Sorry. Everybody was fighting. Hey, we'll pay attention. Could be Spider-Man! <laughs> Another one bites the dust. Let's do this. We'll kill you, Spider-Man! Can't hide. 
Gotta be quicker than that. Get out of here, Spider-Man! This isn't your business! If you give me the new form, we can skip this part! Nap time, bro. Hey! We got Kelsey, you good? Someone go make sure Kelsey's all right. Already on my way. Get him on the back. Take that. One, catch her. Step two, uh, I'll get back to you. Oh, move, move, move. Back off. Move. This is between me and Rob Zod. How about we use our words? How about... You stop being so flinging! Uh, oh, she's not tired yet. It is not going well. Where are you? I don't know. I'm dodging explosions. I need a new strategy. I'm gonna do what you said. Uh, tell her the truth? Yeah, as soon as I catch her. Tinkerer, I gotta tell you something. Slow down. Do you think I'm stupid? You want to hear this? I promise. You have off, Spider-Man. Oh crap! Not good. 
I'm not good! Hope the ship's okay! Good reason not to end you. My mom would be very upset. Miles? Can we just. You two on the roof! Freeze! <laughs> Not great. You still at my place? I'm actually at home. My parents get back next week, so I thought I'd clean. But I could come back. Nah, it's okay. I'll call you later. Now what? Hey, Uncle Aaron. I need, um... I need some advice. About what exactly? Just... everything. Are you free? I can wrap up what I'm doing. Call you in a few. Thanks, man. Talk to you soon. I have no idea where Finn is, or the new form. Guess I should kill some time to Uncle Aaron's free. shut down those areas have seen big decreases in crime and jerks waving around glowy swords the tinker are still a problem but the underground's numbers took a serious hit it was a team effort and i hope your series helps just as much listen if you ever need anything not like a rescue but a, a break from all the fighting text me i know a cafe that makes great matcha lattes <laughs> i'm picturing sitting in a cafe in the mask and it's weird but cool, right? <laughs> okay, bye. Yeah. 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 Gotta lock onto the signal so I can find where the underground's hiding. Locating the source. All right. Now to track them down. Throwing your evil logo on a billboard is definitely a power move. And here's the underground. So, how big is the underground's marketing budget? <laughs> Not to 
disable the transmitter. Signal's clear. I should ask Genki about building some sort of underground ad blocker. in Hell's Kitchen. I'll be there. What am I gonna do about Finn? Try talking to her again? I could meet her somewhere. The Science Center or Trinity Church? No. She knows I lied to her now. She won't want to see me. Spill it. Give me the whole situation. Finn, Roxon, Underground. It's just a lot, you know? You're 17. You're stressed. And you're a superhero. You gotta cut yourself some slack. You still making beats? Not much since I started this. Work-life balance, kid. Most important thing. Here. Little project your dad and I started back in the day. A mixtape. Had rhymes ready and everything. <laughs> How come I never heard about this? Because we never finished. We sampled street noise around the way. Wanted the city to be our beat. But your dad had the masters. And after things went bad between us... <sighs> but you can finish what we couldn't. Plus, it'll take your mind off work. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, what do I do? Load that up. I'll walk you through it. <clears throat> I'll set up holograms to guide you. Scan the source. Holograms, huh? You still in my moves? <laughs> this was in my playbook before you even born, young blood. Okay, don't think about Finn. Focus on sounds. Clear my head. Scan the holograms, and it'll unlock files on that drive I gave you. Hope you figure out which sound you're looking for. Now try and find the original sound, and grab a clean sample. There you go. Yeah, 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 that's it. The rest of the sounds you need are spread across the city. I left a few messages for you, too, to help you get a feel for each location. Oh, dope. Hmm. Not now. Hey, get some you like? Yeah, really unique dynamics. See? Old man still knows his stuff. <laughs> and you were right about clearing my head, too. I know what to do about Finn. I gotta see her. Try to talk her out of all this. In person? Where? Trinity Church. Tomorrow night. Why so interested? Because you got a target on your back the size of Jersey. You don't have to protect me. Someone <laughs> should. You know... You said you never finished this tape because of how things went bad between you and Dad. What actually happened between you two? It was... complicated. We were too similar, and too different. <sighs> Finish the tape, get all the samples, and you'll hear the whole story. Promise. 
All right. Thanks, Unc. Trinity Church. Remember, Tinker is yours, but leave the boy alone. Man, I needed that. I was beat. Okay. I'm gonna call Finn. As soon as I'm ready to go. All right, time to call Finn. Hope she answers. Hi, Spider-Man. Finn, hey, we need to talk. In person. So you can lie to me again? So I can make this right. Please, meet me at Trinity Church. No more lies, I promise. If you're screwing with me, fine. I'll see you there. At least she's willing to meet. Okay, Trinity Church, let's go. Your dad and I fell asleep listening to this sound every night when we were kids. It's got a good beat. Okay, something rhythmic that was around when dad and uncle Aaron were little. I love that rhythm, but the court usually clears out at night. Keep your head up. Kid. Can you say hi to my kid? Us all out. Real heroes what? like you always do. My wife celebrates Kwanzaa. Hmm. There's a subway line near here. Great Christmas. Maybe something mechanical? You can be invisible whenever. Not this way. Yeah, subway comes up over there. Huh. Game's almost on. I'm gonna skedaddle. There's a subway line near here. Later, nerd. Gotta catch a movie. Later. Run! This because it's not Christmas anymore doesn't mean you have to stop. Hmm. There's a subway line near here.
gonna find it over here. Watch it! Me Doesn't really have a beat we could use. Yeah, subway comes up over there. Hey, watch it! Sure, it's behind me. I think it's back there. Nah, getting too far away. Nah, not quite. Yeah, that's it. You probably don't know this, but your dad and I grew up not far from here, before we moved to Brooklyn in high school. Hearing the clatter of the wheels, the squealing when the trains turn or stop, always makes me think of me and your dad's late night talks. Mostly about what we wanted to be when we grew up. I wanted to be a space alien. Your dad's dream changed. Doctor, firefighter, social worker, but he always wanted to help people. Yeah, sounds like that. Hello, friends. This is the Danicast with our debate. And That's your intro? Lame! We in the business call that burying the lead. Pipe it up! Let me ask you something, Danny. Do you ever think about what you're inciting? About your journalistic integrity? More than some. Because your campaign against Roxxon is baffling to an actual journalist like myself. You should be attacking the young, unproved vigilante who keeps causing problems in Harlem. You, you twist everything Spider-Man does into something malicious while simultaneously excusing everything Roxxon does wrong. All Spider-Man needs for you to support him is to get a better PR department. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. The only problem Spider-Man fixes are the ones he causes. I won't praise the arsonist for putting out his fire. Meanwhile, Roxxon built a beautiful plaza in a failing neighborhood. By tearing down homes and businesses, our new Spider-Man is proving that Harlem isn't the failure Roxxon makes it out to be. And you, Mr. Jameson, for someone who claims to love New York, you sure do seem to hate New Yorkers. You are clearly emotional, young lady, so I'm invoking the mercy rule on this debate. Jared, shut it down! And whose idea was it to debate a teenager? There are no good optics to destroying a child! Get the car! I need a hot stone massage! Hello? Hello? Uh, yeah. Well, thanks for the debate that you demanded, Mr. Jameson. To everyone else, remember to stand up every half hour while working at a computer. Bye! This is a good one. Me and your dad used to hang around here. Listen while the whole station came alive. That's what you need. Something at the station.
I think hanging around here is how your dad got the idea to be a cop. I said, man, you're not uptight enough for that job. You wanted to make things better from the inside. Pretty sure I died trying. You did make things better, Dad. And so will I. aren't cut out to be superheroes. Ain't no shame in that. This one was all your dad's idea. You need something that's always in this part. Quiet on their own. Loud in a group. Loud in a group? Uh... Hmm. Back there. The bridge wasn't your fault. Pretty sure it's behind me. Probably something you'd always find here, like birds or trees or... No, no, not trees. How did Dad record this? Was he a pigeon whisperer? This was way back, before high school. We were hanging in the park one day, and someone dropped a hot dog. You know how that goes. The place was swarming with pigeons. The dad stopped cold. He said, Aaron, man, that's some music. Listen. Next day, we were crawling all over Manhattan looking for beats, like you are now. I remember the first time they showed me how to sample. Uncle Aaron had the gear, and Dad had the ear for music. Your mom lived here right after college. You know that? She and your dad were dating. Three of us spent a lot of time here. We got used to this soft, steady beat. Soft beat. What a good beat. Things were good back then. Felt like they'd be good forever. Your mom got her first gig as a teacher. Your dad was new to being a cop, and I just started calling myself the prop. I figured we all kept secrets about our jobs. But last though, your dad's job and mine crossed paths too often. Man, Uncle Aaron, if you would have been anything else, my mom and dad would have supported you all the way. Stop me if you've heard this one. Spider-Man chases villain through sea. Millions of dollars of property damage fall. We're still tallying up the damage from Rhino's rampage. Then the bridge disaster. And now it seems the junior menace decided to go for the hat trick with his new frenemy, the Tinkerer. I say those two should get a room, preferably a prison cell, and hash out their differences in private, somewhere very, very far from New York. And I don't just mean Jersey. I'm talking Oregon or even Alaska. And maybe I could have one peaceful night at home watching the great Wakandan cook-off without getting interrupted by my fire escape being torn off the side of my building. Darn it, that reminds me. Jared, did you set my DVR? Times Square. 
Easy to find someone in the crowd here. Or lose them. Sound you need's like an electric current. A current? I could cheat it with venom. <laughs> nah. back there. Too far away. Oh, that's cool. I love how alive that feels. After I started calling myself a problem, met my first client right under this sign. Neon flags hard to miss, and the crowd makes it easy to blend in. She wanted me to steal a painting. I looked across the square and saw your dad looking back at me. He never said anything. Just turned and left. He didn't know everything. Just that I was a thief. But that was enough. I think he saw where we were headed long before I did. If he would have tried to act right sooner, he would have forgiven you. I know he would have. This sound always feels like someone celebrating, even when it's just telling time. Your dad thought so too, so we had to include it. A sound that tells time. Okay. behind me. Man. Man, time to spend all that money I don't have. I'm just gonna... You said it sounded like a celebration. Nice, but doesn't tell time. Pretty sure phones can ring whenever. Has to be something else. He said it sounded like a celebration. I'm celebrating something that does both. Hate to leave you hanging. <laughs> I 
time celebrating something that does both. Ringing on the hour. When I hear those bells, I remember the last time I was here. Your dad had just graduated from the police academy. I didn't go to the ceremony, so I met him here after. Bought us milkshakes. Strawberry for him, peanut butter for me. I don't know why I remember that. He said he couldn't cover for me anymore if I got in trouble. I told him I was done with that life. I was lying, but he believed me. Wow. At least pretended to. Man, things got complicated between them. Folks, the Feast Centers have had a rough go ever since their founder, Martin Lee, turned out to be the mad bomber known as Mr. Nick. But I believe in the Feast Centers. Because I knew May. The brave woman who literally gave her life to keep them going. So I was distressed to hear the Harlem branch recently suffered a damaging blow. With us is Glory, director of that center. Yeah, thanks. Uh, anyone who wants to donate to the cleanup, check out our website. It's tax deductible. Wonderful. I'm donating 10% of my paycheck for this week. And half of Jerry's. Now, I'm hearing Spider-Man may have been responsible for the flood. No way. Someone was responsible, but it wasn't Spider-Man. Follow the money. Who benefits from lower property values? And I'm going to stop you there, because we have a strict policy of not saying anything that will get me sued. Incidentally, I'm pretty sure Spider-Man can't afford lawyers. He wasn't Spider-Man. We're out of time. Thanks so much for joining us, Gloria. And remember, everyone, if you want to be a real hero, not like a certain masked menace. Donate to Feast. Jared, cut her mic before. That was a hell of a way to tell me you're Spider Man. What if I'd killed you? Do you want me to feel bad because you almost killed me? I want you to stop lying to me. I let you in the underground because I thought you understood. I do understand. What Krieger did to Rick? Roxxon needs to pay. Not like this. This is the only way I can beat him. I need you to look the other way. Please. I can't. I made a promise. So did I. Why'd you pick here? My dad brought us. To that concert. Seven choirs from seven countries. Remember? Ghana was my favorite. Ghana wasn't there. You're thinking of Guinea. No, no, I'm pretty sure it was Ghana. Guinea, Belize, Poland, Cuba. South Korea, Thailand, Venezuela. You're right. I usually am. Usually. <laughs> what? Cut 
gotta say, I'm disappointed, but Krieger. Yeah. See, Miss Mason. Kinda knew she was gonna be a handful. But you. I guess I was hoping that you and me would see eye to eye. Where are we? <sighs> You're behind the curtain, bud. <laughs> this is our most secure facility. In here, the sausage gets made. You're a real prick, you know that? Hmm. You know, when her brother and I were developing new form... All you did was put your name on the patent. He said the only thing you knew how to do was sell other people's ideas. You know, at least I still got a pulse, babe. But let's not dwell, right? The first thing we're gonna do is I'm going to... <clears throat> Wow. <laughs> that is awesome. Are those involuntary defenses? Oh man, that's hot. You see, I'm gonna get that mask off you. And I'm gonna find out what makes you tick. Because you just smell like next level bioengineering. And you know what that smells like to me, kid? <clears throat> That smells like money. Okay, I'm gonna hit the gym. Leg day, can't skip it. Get her to tell us where my new form is. Yeah. Can't really open the plaza without it. Oh, and uh, use him. Time to finish what we started on the bridge. No cameras now. <laughs> Kill you. <clears throat> Holy shit. Tougher than I look, huh? <sighs> Let's find a way out of here. <sighs> Roxon kept Rhino instead of giving him to the police. Crazy. Nothing about Roxanne surprises me anymore. You okay? I will be, once we're out. I'm shutting off security cams. Can you check that computer? What did you find? There's the exit, through this office. We have to lift the base lock down first, from the control room. First, we need to escape the security wing. I'll go down to the floor, see what we're dealing with. Door's locked. Venom worked in the cell. Should work on the door. I can find whatever's happening. Hello. It's unlocked. I'm headed to the floor. Right above you. That security door is our way out, but I'll have to hack a few terminals to disable the alarm. I'll handle the security goons. Security cameras are down in the south wing. Rhino probably turned them off. Heard he wanted to question the prison. Bet that other guy could get even Spider-Man to squeal. I think we're secure. What's up with these power outages? Your lucky day. There's two more ahead. How do we even find those two? Did Rhino track them? No, he's just a tool. Point and shoot. An outside agent gave us their location. Heard something. Stand by. Get rid of 
Way's clear. Checking the perimeter. Running a cipher. You full duty at the plaza yet? We're working okay. overtime to get that place Ready for open. another computer. Finn, you gotta talk. Blowing up the plaza is a bad idea. So is poisoning the city with an unsafe fuel source. Yeah, but there has to be a better way to deal with rock salt. Sometimes strategies are imperfect, like deciding to lie to your friends. Let's just focus on getting out. Fine, but we're gonna talk about this. Area secure. Another win for Spider-Man. Weapons hot. Requesting backup. Someone cover me. We can't let Spider-Man leave. Night. Hurry up and flush him out. the maglock. I need you to trigger the override back there. On it. Looks like some kind of record archive. Wonder what's on these computers. More info on Rhino. I know he says he wants out of that suit, but let's face it, the metal onesie is the only reason anyone gives a damn about him. Just upgrade his armor. If we help him smash Kid Spider, he'll forget all about wanting out. There's nobody this guy won't manipulate. Notes about Roxxon independent contractors. We need an outside partner to track Tinker and Spider-Man for us. Tombstone's off the grid. Black Cat's gone straight-ish. What about the guy in the purple? What did he go by? What was his name? Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, he'll do. Guy in purple? That can't be. No, no way. Triggering the override. There's a voice memo on here. Sir, the police are asking about Rhino. What do we tell them? Our man at the Raft is setting up a special work release program. Tell the police Rhino's doing the little community service. Can't believe they got away with this. Force it open. Can do. Okay, really. I can't let them go until they have my new form. You shouldn't even be here. Your muscle was only supposed to grab the girl. <sighs> yeah, he didn't like that. Here's the deal, bud. Spider-Man's the best leverage I got against Miss Mason. I mean, you caught them together. Well, I mean, you caught them, but it was thanks to your intel. So, clearly there's something going on there. You agreed to leave the kid alone. Uncle Aaron? Ah, the kid. I love how you say that. It's just so paternal. Let Spider-Man go, and I'll get you new for him. Feed you underground intel, whatever you want. See? Leverage. Works every time. My... Spider-Man! Here's leverage for you. I've seen things. New form making people sick. What you did to Rick Mason. If I went public... Yeah, but you won't. Here's the deal. You're a wanted thief. Plus, all the jobs we've done together. <laughs> but you'd be in the cell right next to mine. And we both know you're a little too self-serving for that. So, we're gonna head in and check on Miss Mason and Spider-Man. Uh, but it's kind of an invite-only party. Yeah. Bye. Where? No. Wait. Do you know that guy? 
Is that the reason we got captured? No. It's... I knew he worked with Roxxon, but I didn't think he'd... He'd sell me out. I can't believe this. You led me into a trap. Why do I keep listening to you? Finn, no. There has to be an explanation. I didn't know this would happen. Just save it. Let's keep moving. Yeah, sure. They initiated a lockdown. That's the control room we have to get into. So we need past those security shutters. Got a maintenance panel here, but it needs power. Let me see what I can do. Gotta be attached to a generator. Just need some venom, and we'll have power. There! You've got power. Accessing... Ugh. I can't hotwire the shutters, but I can move machinery, like that crane. Maybe we can use that. I'll look around. They build engines for their APCs in here. Hey, I can raise and lower that crane. Is that useful? Maybe this crane can help us out somehow. Hey, crane's over this engine thing now. Engine thing. I've got an idea. Can we move the crane back to the assembly line? Yeah, I think I know where you're headed. Okay, this laser should activate the engine. Ugh, crap. Laser shorted out. I think I can reroute power. The laser shorted, but it still works. Needs a new power source. Nice. Webs are conducting electricity. I could use those nodes and some webs. We route power to the laser. Glasses in the way. There's a note on that crane. You're good. Use a laser. One laser coming up. Perfect. If I overcharge the engine, it'll be explosive. And explosive is just what we need to destroy those shutters. Time to make it explosive. Yeah. Get down! Let's go! Almost out! That's our way out. Give me a few minutes to get it open. 
It looks like they guessed our plan. Not hard. There's only one exit. All right. I'll take care of those guards. You get that door open. Ugh, one thing. Did you ever think about calling me to tell me you were Spider-Man? You know, after my parents died, Rick basically had to become my dad. I thought I'd miss having a brother, but I had you. Finn, I... Get this door open! That won't hold forever! Go! I'll be fine, just go! Those guys with the lights on their helmets can spot heat signatures. They'll see you if you try to go invisible. Wonder how much of their R&D department is dedicated to fighting us. Probably millions of dollars in untaxed money. You clear the floor, I'll work on overriding security so we can get out. I can still access machinery if you need me to move anything. You good in there? Yeah, those webs are holding the door. Whole base is on alert though, so be careful. There's only one way out of the base. RX-73, all clear in your sector? Bet you didn't see that coming. No response. Check it out. Copy that. I'm en route. do to change that stop going behind my back and stop acting like I haven't thought this through no one will get hurt when I take down the plaza no one except Roxon you know they deserve it just I promise to talk it through with me, okay? I promise to listen really listen I've made up my mind miles you need to start accepting that then I'm gonna have to stop you you need to start accepting that I'm through. Meet me in the showroom on the far side of the assembly line. See you there. When you find the target, neutralize him. Ah! Gotta be quicker than that. Coming. 
Looks like they locked the doors. I'll find another way. What if we went public about Rick's death? Do you have proof? Because I don't think the word of two vigilantes is going to convince people. There's got to be a way. I think that's the exit. Hey. Lost and found. Thanks. I know this place. This is Krieger's lab. Krieger has a lab? Mostly for show, but yeah. Rick showed me a photo once. Krieger's lab? Wait. All the current New Front Project data's on here. Toxicity reports, failed safety reviews, and Krieger's name's on everything. This would destroy Roxxon. You like my new color? Immune to your little zappy pops. Zappy pops? Come on, man. Now, be finished this!
ready for a nap? I do not. Wait. Just make sure he doesn't do anything. I'll be right back. Krieger said he'll shut Roxxon down the right way. You know, Krieger told me how your brother died. Very amusing. Shut up. <laughs> he also told me it was your fault. <laughs> Krieger updated the reactor. Tried to supercharge it to make his deadline. If thing goes through with her plan... Oh my god. Harlem. You ought to die. Helpless. <laughs> no, no, no! Go to hell. He's dead. Genki. I need help. I'm gonna go grab a washcloth. Some antibiotics. Finn's attacking the plaza. Yeah. So that was you chasing her through the city. As Spider-Man. You could have died. No lo puedo creer. Why didn't you tell me about any of this? All those talks we had? How to keep yourself safe? But this... I didn't want you to worry. And the other Spider-Man's gone. I just keep making things worse and worse. And I screwed up things with you. Miles. There is nothing you could ever do or ever be that would make me stop loving you. Nada. You give me strength, Miles. That's all a hero really is. Someone who's brave for the people they love. Just a guy who doesn't give up. Gloria's handling Feast, and Teo's gonna help us go door to door. Perfect. Let's get this evacuation started. I'll meet you outside. You remind me more of your father every day. You stay safe. Well. Hey, I'm telling people in Harlem they need to evacuate before me and your mom go door to door. Okay, cool. I I wanted to say thanks for always having my back, man. Hey, I could use your help before you go. 
You got it. I want to cross-reference underground activity with buildings that could store new form. Maybe you could hack Oscorp surveillance towers, or... I'm in. It'll take a while to narrow down. That's all right. Thanks, man. Gonna stretch my legs a little, then head out. <laughs>